Hi everybody, this is Katie from Tropical Looms, and today I'll be showing you how to make a bracelet. But before we make the bracelet, let's give out, let's give some shout outs first to Master Awesome 101 and Loomer AJ, and they're both on YouTube, and this is how they're spelled. Yeah, if you're wondering why I covered that up, it actually shows some personal information. So yeah. Um, well, it's in my state, so I don't mind. I'll tell you where I live. <laughs> I'll just tell you this. I live in the U.S. That's all I'm saying. So yeah. But anyways, Loomer AJ and Master Awesome 101 have subscribed to me. And also, you can check out their awesome channels. So yeah, we're actually making a bracelet now. Let me just show you what it looks like. Today we'll be making the Riched Up Bracelet, which is a hook-only design. And I designed this a while ago. It's actually based off of Tiger Girl's Zigrack bracelet, and it looks really awesome. Both of the bracelets look really awesome. But I'll be showing you how to make this ridge up, ridged up bracelet, and yeah, let's get started with the bracelet. I forgot to tell you that I recommend using limited edition bands for the bracelet, just because there is, it won't get the same look if you don't use limited edition bands. You'll have a really bad crummy look. I don't want, I don't want you to have a crummy look on the bracelet, so. Yeah, so, yeah, and you will need a hook, I'll be using a rainbow and brand metal hook, one C-clip, and two colors of bands, I recommend using two colors, and I'll be using the Rainbow and Web Store's limited edition bands, the gold mint, peach frost. So anyways, let's get started with the Rich Up Bracelet. So you're going to get your hook. What you're first gonna do is you're gonna grab your first color. You're just gonna make a regular cap band. There you go, just like that. And then you're gonna grab your next color. Just pull it through. Well, not that color, sorry. Go to grab your gold pin and pull it through, just like that. And then you're gonna grab. To grab this first band twister hook and pull your there's another way to do it I'll show you you don't twist the bands around or else the bracelet will look very different and I actually did create a variation of it by doing that by twisting the hook around so anyway you're gonna grab your gold mint is you can grab these bands and bring them over like that. But wait, another way to do it is you're gonna grab the first band and twist your hook. And then let those bands go on. A little sticky thing. Then you're gonna grab your peach frost. We're gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna grab onto this one. just as well but personally I like doing it the other way oh and by the way this bracelet's reversible and that's what it looks like on the reversed side it's pretty cool but I personally don't need to wear it on that side so you're gonna grab a peach frost and a hair wow Keep on doing 
this until you have the length of your bodice. Oh my gosh, hair again! Are you kidding me? Do you see that? I have really long hair. If you didn't know. Okay. Long hair. There we go. And you're gonna just do the same thing. Anyway, this is what it'll look like, and I'm just going to show you one more time. Just going to pick something. Here we go. There we go. Um, we're going to grab your gold mint. going to pull it through like that. Whoop. There we go. And now I'm going to go off camera to finish the length of my bracelet. When you're done with the length of your bracelet, your bracelet should look like this. And I know we didn't do the whole length of it. I don't really care because I'm not, I'm not obsessed with this bracelet. And what you're going to do is you're going to take all these bands off. What you're going to do is you're actually going to grab this band and pull it. You put it on your finger. Anyways, thanks for watching this tutorial on my ridged up bracelet. Please give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below and you can follow me on Google+. And yeah, thank you for watching this tutorial.